Some have already received the direct deposits from President Biden's $1.9 trillion COVID-19 relief package. Others are checking their accounts pretty regularly to see when they'll actually hit. Fox 55's Nico Panisi is live in downtown Fort Wayne tonight, where he spoke with residents about how this money is helping them. Nico, what do folks have planned in store? Chris, whether it's for splurging or for spending, Fort Wayne residents are grateful that they'll be seeing dollar signs in their bank account. Some say that after a year of hard work, some people being laid off, and others saying that money is really tight, that they're excited for this added bonus. Katie Chrismore has had a long year. Her medical bills started to pile up when she was diagnosed with a lymphoma-like blood disorder. Lab work, medication, and doctor's visits meant money out of her pocket, which the first stimulus check helped cover. It, it took care of the bills, you know, so I didn't have that worry anymore. A nurse's aide at Fort Wayne's Parkview Health, Chris Moore is working long shifts, sometimes upwards of 14 hours. And with her blood disorder in remission, she plans to use this stimulus for herself. It'll spell out love you to the moon and back around my arm. A tattoo, paying homage to her children. I never do anything for me because it's always like, you know, it's just me and my kids. So now that I have a chance to spend a little bit on me, I'm going to. 26-year-old Kirsten Baumgartner says her stimulus is going right into her Roth IRA. This is another time where I could save the money, and so I decided to put it towards my retirement. I mean, <laughs> never too early. Baumgartner says she's lucky to have not lost her job during the pandemic. But I know a lot of people that have, or they, they were used to two incomes and they went down to one. That's the case for Lauren Caggiano. We're kind of managed now by the board. When her husband was laid off during the pandemic, any income went towards basic needs. All of the things that we take for granted that are part of our daily life, some people do not have the money to, to meet all of his expenses. Caggiano is putting her stimulus money towards car maintenance. As I'm self-employed, my car is everything. So if I don't have a running vehicle, then I'm out of luck. She says the extra cash puts her at ease, knowing her car is one less thing she has to worry about. 85% of Americans qualify for the stimulus check. It's President Biden's goal that millions of payments be dispersed in the coming weeks. In Fort Wayne, I'm Nico Panisi, Fox 55 News.